How to use lasso tools in Adobe Photoshop CS6. Hello there. In this lesson, we'll learn how to use lasso tools in Adobe Photoshop CS6. As you already know that there are three types of lasso tools, which are lasso tool, polygonal lasso tool, and magnetic lasso tool. In this tutorial, we will see the use of all three lasso tools. So for that, we have an image open here in Adobe Photoshop application. Let's first select the lasso tool from the toolbar. Press and hold on to the left button of the mouse from one point and drag around the flower and make sure you come back to the point where you started from. You need to make sure to complete the loop. Now we want to cut this selected area out of the original image. Now by pressing the Ctrl plus J of your keyboard, your selection will open up in a different layer. Let's hide the background layer. You'll see that our selected area is only available on the layer now. Now that you can see that the edges are not quite accurately cut out of the actual image, as you can see the extra part here, now we will take the polygonal lasso tool. Let's zoom in to see the outline more clearly. Now the best part of the polygonal lasso tool is, you can click and give a pause while selecting the outline of the flower. So let's select the outline of the flower and with the polygonal tool, you would be able to do it more exactly. Now remember that if while selecting the outline, you want to go back to your previous point of selection, you can just do that by pressing the backspace of your keyboard. Also, you need to make sure that you are completing the loop of your selection area. Now by pressing the Ctrl J of a keyboard, your new selection will open up in a different layer again. Let's hide layer 1. Now let's take a new layer. Then select the foreground color as you like. Now select the paint bucket tool from the toolbar and click on here. You will see the new layer which is active here has been filled up with the selected color. Bring layer 3 below layer 2. Now let's press Ctrl and select both the layer 3 and layer 2. Right click on here and merge both the layers. Now let's take the magnetic lasso tool. Click on one point 
hold on the left button of the mouse and just drag your mouse over the outline of the flower you'll see that the tool is automatically selecting the outline edges of the flower once again we need to complete the loop of the selection Now from the menu bar, let's go to edit and copy. Let's open the file that we want to use as the background of the flower. Let's go to file, open and go to the location of the file and open. Now let's go to edit and paste. Now press Ctrl T to transform it and resize the selection. Let's put it in the perfect place. So we have seen the use of all three lasso tools in this tutorial. Thank you.